hello everyone in this video I will show how to run Nirgum first time so go to browser and we have already downloaded Nirgum so the venue, uh, you need to go to this website and Nirgum just search Nirgum in Google and download Nirgum I have already downloaded this one once this download downloading is done extract your Nirgum simulator so we will extract that simulator on desktop okay now it's extracted not uh, now what you have to do open your terminal our simulator is actually stored on desktop so we need to change directory we will go to desktop then we need to enter in Nirgum directory okay now we are in Nirgum now what we have to do just execute make command so when you will execute this make command you will get error like this one uh, it will say mutable is not allowed so what you have to do in order to resolve this error go to this file so it is saying system c include sys data type bit and sc bit proxies dot h so go to your nirgum directory So here is our Nirgam. We will open it and uh, so it's saying system C. We will go in system C and then in system C it's saying include sysc data type bit and this is the file which is having problem. So what you need to do just uh, search for search for mutable keywords so wherever you will find these keywords just delete them so again we will search mutable so these are more so we will delete them as well okay so now mutable keywords are deleted save this file Again, try to run make command. So this command if we build your Nirgum simulator that executable file, which we will run. Just wait for some time. Actually, after making changes in that file sc proxies bit proxies dot h uh, when we try to make our nirgum there will be one more error so if you can see here uh, it is showing one error here in this line it's saying unrecognized command line option minus w1 so in order to resolve this what you have to do go to your nirgum directory again open this file make file dot DEFC. So in this file, uh, just see where is this W1. So if you can see, we are having W1 here. So we will replace this one by L. Save this file and now again make it. Okay, so now uh, this building is done successfully. There is no problem. How to run Nirgum? So we need to write this one and it will run Nirgum. So if you are uh, seeing this error, there is one more error. So in order to resolve this, what you have to do uh, here, write export sc signal right check disable though this one is not a permanent solution if you are going for this solution every time whenever you want to run Nirgum simulator whenever you will open this terminal in this terminal always you have to write this line and then 
Uh, so here, now we will run our Belgium simulation. So now it's successfully executed. Uh, there is another one solution. What is that? Instead of uh, writing that line again and again, just write that line in bash rc file. So how to do that? Run this command sudo gedit bash rc. It will ask you for password. And in this file, at the end, we will make our entry. So we will write the same line here. Export sc signal disable check. Sorry, this one is right check. Disable. Save it. So this is the permanent solution. If you are making this entry in bash rc file now, uh, no need to specify that thing on terminal. So this is the way to run Nirgam first time. How to install it and how to run it first time. In next tutorial we will see how to simulate different different scenario for Nirgam. Thank you very much for watching.